So you're definitely aggressive in the ring, but are you lethal outside the ring as well? I'm quite chilled, normally, unless someone upsets me. Are you into, I'm not trying to upset him. <laughs> Let's keep it calm, breathe. Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I know that there's a lot of hitting going on, but would you like a woman to hit on you tonight? I wouldn't mind, but I think my wife would really mind, so no. Maybe that would upset her and she's going to find me, right, for yeah, that question. Yeah, you know, then I don't, this is the least of my worries, trust me. How does it feel to be a part of SFL? Oh, I love it, I love it, it's great. It's uh, all you guys, you know, all you guys make it a great event. It's all, the production's really good. And, you know, it's nice to fight in front of so many great Indian fans. So, yeah, I like it, it's a lot of fun. Show us some dance moves for her, considering it's a party and we've seen your, you know, the fight moves. Oh, sure, no problem. This is called the chicken dance. There's some more. <laughs> is, that, is that dedicated that to your wife? Well, our with us is Anoop Gujateng. And Anoop, tell us how did you fight in today's fight? When I was going to fight in the first round, I was very scared. So, when I saw the crowd in Delhi, and I was going to go so much, I was so good. And I was so good that I was going to fight in the first round. Is there any other person who is going to fight in the life? 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 I will fight for my country and for no one else. I will fight for India. Do you think that the girls are more attracted to the fighter? No, I don't think so. I will tell you. Do you have any other people? No, no. Do you want to dance? Yes. Like this? Yes. 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 What do you think of SFL coming to India now? Let's go. Like I said before, it's a, it's a warrior spirit we have inside. It just waken. It's been hibernating for generations, and SFL has brought it out alive. We are here, world. Watch out. We are India. <laughs> Would you say for, for uh, a, a format like this, you need more muscle or strategy? Well, a format like this, you need everything. This is the ultimate sport. You need cardio. You need strength. You need fast twitch muscles, slow twitch muscles. You need wrestling, jiu-jitsu, skipping. Everything in the world, any sport, this is the ultimate sport. So what we're trying to do is uh, Raj Kundra has brought MMA to India. A lot of people don't know what it is. It's the fastest going sport and you will love to love it. Otherwise, uh -huh. just, just when he said the name, here we have it, people, Raj Kundra himself. I'm not going to take any credit. I'm going to give a lot of credit to uh, the man who makes Indian MMA really happen. His name is Daniel Isaac. Daniel, can we have you here, please? The real man, the real man behind Indian MMA. It was this guy, when I Googled, before I started any of this MMA, I Googled Indian MMA. And the first name that came up was Daniel Isaac. And he's going to tell us how he selects the, the Indian crew and what goes behind all the training. Well, it's not too difficult to actually select Indian guys. Because Indians, as, as Kultar says, Indians have heart, you know. So all you got to do is bring them, put them in the gym, and get them the best training. And that's what this man has done. Well, look what I've done. I've managed to get the man away from all the buzz around so that I can have his attention solely. So here I am. All I want to know for now is how is it shaping up in your eyes? SFL in India? Oh, good question. We started with Mumbai, which was fantastic. We had 5,000 people turn up and um, it, it's a new sport so people don't understand it and that's why we're using Bollywood and, and Zoom to promote what we're doing. Um, Chandigarh, uh, again, a little bit of uh, lack of education but they were picking it up and we had about 3,500. By the time we got to Delhi, thanks to you guys and thanks to everyone who's sort of promoted MMA, we have had today 12,200 people. Um, and we thought after Bollywood, let's see how many leave because, you know, you've come for the concert. Are you going to stay for the fight? Everyone stayed. So it was just fantastic. It was overwhelming to see them shout and scream and support for their Indian fighters. Um, I think the potential is huge. We had Kapil Dev come today and he said, it's amazing to see people take a day off from IPL for SFL. So um, that was a great sort of endorsement and uh, yeah, it's looking it's good. It's a good positive feedback there and, and I, we were trying to do our own homework and we figured that it is going house full. Yep, absolutely, house full uh, and that too in between IPL. So it shows that uh, cricket is great, cricket is fun, but uh, people want alternative sports and they want to, you know, I'm not putting you out at four in the afternoon in the hot sun, you're getting an AC indoor stadium. Um, but no, jokes apart, cricket is cricket, you can't break it. Um, but there are there is scope for alternative sport in the country and SFL is working. What are you expecting from tonight's part? Um, just all the fighters to go crazy and let their hair down. They've been training for the last few months and uh, yeah, I'm going to be managing them and keeping an eye on them as well.